Male or female, no matter which golden retriever you choose, you're gonna get a full package of love, affection, and loads of playfulness. However, there are some major differences between both the genders, which we will look into in this video of retriever care. The first, and the major difference between male and female golden retrievers, is the size. Male retrievers are physically bigger and taller than the females. While an average male golden retriever stands at around 23 to 24 inches, the female retrievers are usually between 21 to 22 inches. And an average male weighs between 65 to 75 pounds. Females weigh between 55 to 65 pounds. So, as you can see, male goldens are around 2 inches taller and 5 to 10 pounds heavier than females. Apart from their size and weight, male retrievers also have a greater mane and slightly longer fur. On the other hand, females have narrow noses and heads compared to their male counterparts. There isn't any major difference in the temperament and personality between male and female goldens. Both of them are equally active, playful, and loving. But according to R. Anna Johnson, an award-winning breeder, male golden retrievers often display a survival trait of worshiping the leader of the pack. However, female goldens do not go overboard in worshiping the leader. But this does not mean that females are not loving and loyal. It just means that they have a slightly lower drive to please their owners than their male counterparts. But, well, every dog has a different personality, and it also depends on how well they were raised. Even though female golden retrievers have slightly lower drive to please their owners, they are easier to train than their male counterparts. Male goldens are less focused and have very little attention span. They easily get distracted. More than one study has proved that male goldens are more difficult to house train than females. But again, regardless of gender, it all depends on how much effort you put on training your golden retriever. Both genders have the same life expectancy of 10 to 12 years, but there are certain health conditions which are gender related. So before you decide, make sure to ask a vet about these health problems. Estrus cycle occurs in female golden retrievers once every six months. In simple words, they are fertile during this time and receptive to males for mating. Males, on the other hand, do not go through such a cycle. Female goldens bleed during the estrus cycle, which can last for 7 to 13 days. Both the genders are active in nature. However, male goldens can be more playful and energetic than females. Golden Retrievers are super friendly and docile dogs, and we rarely get to see any serious behavior problems, like aggression. And it all depends on the training and care you give your dog. But as we discussed above, females are more independent than males and slightly more territorial. And unneutered males often develop the habit of peeing at different corners of the house to mark their territory. But with proper training, this can be resolved. As you can see, there aren't any major differences between both of them that can make one gender better than the other. Be it a male or a female, Golden Retrievers are one of the best dogs in the world. I hope this video was helpful. Let me know your decision in the comments down below. See ya!